Like we're OGs, all right? Because you know these people, because you're you're with it like that, your editing is gonna far supersede people who are much better at the software than you. What makes good video editing is w like using the tools in the right way. Knowing what to put where is a much stronger skill than knowing how to put things in the right place. But that's just my, my philosophy for editing. I don't like doing all this extra, like everybody nowadays, you'll see people like throwing hella stuff in their videos, putting like, well, let me have my video on tripods and gimbals and all of this, like thousands of dollars worth of equipment and effects. And I'm like, for me, it's like, nah, just less is more, just be simple with it, you know? But oh shit, you moved to your room in the office, yeah. I have, I have everything in this one room, but yeah. Uh, Damn, I was gonna make the software, I was gonna make the video editing tier list. Okay, in this, there's there's one obvious pick, okay? This is a Premiere Pro, this is what you just learned, all right? Premiere Pro is really good, it's really good. It's the best of the best, but it's very, very buggy. That's why you're gonna love autosave. You just have to learn to work with the bugs is what I've learned. YouTube Video Editor, it's great for what it is, okay? But this, Windows Movie Maker, God tier. Nothing comes close, nothing comes close to the legendary Windows Movie Maker. Okay. And, and Phil Morris garbage, Every, everything else is bad. Everything else is bad. After Effects is, no, nothing else can be in God tier. Nothing else can. Um, Final Cut Pro, bro, I was using Final Cut Pro back when it was Final Cut Pro 7. Now they're on Final Cut Pro X. And dude, Premiere used to be so much better. Like, I like how that's the OG Windows Movie Maker. <laughs> <laughs> no. the, the old one, the new one's shit, dude. The new actually shit. The old one was so easy to use, and you can basically do anything on it. That's what I thought was insane. Like, or not anything, but you can do so much on it, you know, for like its time. And it was free and easy to use and access. Like, dude, as a kid, I figured that shit out like it was nothing. Dude, that's what I made that Fiddlesticks video on. Remember when I'm like running mm -hmm. around, I'm like, fuck yeah. you, Gooby, I made it on. I movie bad. No, I movie bad. No, I movie's good for what it is. I you have to look at these things for what they are. Okay. It's like the no, it's, it's like the Windows Movie Maker of the current time, but you need a Mac product to, to like use it. No, That's no, but 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 here's the thing. It's like you look at it for what it is, dude. For like a ten year old, it's the best editor, bro. Just to get the hang of editing and just to understand how editing works, it's the best. And so many great memories, dude. It's just like it's just like Windows Movie Maker for me, but. Uh, it's like, dude, if you look at these things for what they are, like, dude, After Effects, everything you can do in Premiere, you can do in After Effects, but After Effects can animate. After Effects, you can import 3D assets into and literally animate them. Keyframing in After Effects is next level, dude. Like, you haven't seen nothing with keyframing. If, if you're comparing all these things, After Effects goes on top and everything else goes several tiers lower. But uh, Vegas, dude, okay, I'm putting Vegas up here and then I'm putting this over here. Um, this is the newer Vegas, but this is Vegas 17, I believe, or 18, something like that. I don't know what the hell this is, and I don't know what this is. I don't know why they have Vegas Pro down here. Everyone likes to shit on Vegas. It's a great program, um, but it's it crashes a lot. And the YouTube video editor, I mean, like, it's good for what it is. For, for the purposes, dude, you don't want to give people great, like, editing power with YouTube, you know? Cause it's like, you never know what's authentic and what's not, you know, you never know. Oh, did this guy do this when he uploaded the video? You want people to upload the video as their final form. The YouTube video editor lets you do two things. It lets you cut things out, trim things, and it lets you censor things. That's it. That's all it lets you do. And it's like, that's perfect. That's all people should have the ability to do after they upload a YouTube video. I don't want to see all this extra stuff put in there afterwards. It should be authentic, you know? Yeah. But yeah, everything else is, and Camtasia, I'm putting Camtasia down here. Cause Camtasia is like, I mean, you can record your screen with it, but I mean, we got OBS now and we had fraps back then. So nah, it's shit tier. And this is the only God tier. I'm, I, 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 I wish I could add a tier. I wish I could add another one in between. So, because nothing even comes close to this. 